just going to have a look at the electrics for lathe now. So what, what I've done then, I've had a rule around my stash, which I, I never throw anything away, and I found this vintage switch. I wish it was black, but beggars can't be choosers, can they? It's probably 50 year old this switch, it's come off a, off a it's an M&K, and it must be, it's come off a pump, and it must be, I'm guessing 50 year old at least, maybe more. Uh, so that's my switch, I suppose I could spray it black if I need to. Then I've got this uh, metal vintage socket, m and I know this is a f over 40 year old, in fact it could be 50. Because uh, I can remember putting this onto something when I was an apprentice. I've just dismantled it because I no longer use the item and I've took this off it. So I know that is uh, 50 year old or 45 perhaps. And then I've got this, it's a modern light but it looks the part on the lathe, it's got a broken clip so I'm going to cut this broken clip off and bolt this to the underside of the swarf tray so that this can be positioned anywhere on the lathe. Um, I want to put this socket on with a trailing cable because I've got some, uh, I've got in mind for future to make some accessories accessories for this lathe. And the belts off the lathe, the old base stand and the lathe dismantles and leaves the motor on this base plate. So I want to wire it in in such a way that I'm not fastening my switch to any part of the lathe otherwise I can't, dis I can't take it off the base plate not without taking the wires, dismantling the wires. I've got some accessories in mind for future and I will want to sock it and I'll also want to sock it for this light so I'm going to put a socket here and then have a trailing lead off to go to the mains but I'm going to put my switch there so I can lift the lathe off and it not interfere with the switch so basically to switch lathe on you've just got to you know put your hand to one side and do it which is not a problem because it's that small I could put I could put it anywhere couldn't I really it's it's not going to be uh, out of way wherever I put it um, and then my light if I chop this broken bracket off here this broken spring clip I can probably fit my light under here and that will um, bolt to the swarf tray like that I can cut that off and then it should create its own switch on and I can manoeuvre that to wherever I want it so that's my plan
Well, I guess that's it then. Jobs are good then. Uh, oh, just one last thing to do, ain't there? Well, I'm going to call microchip completed. Uh, microchips were not invented when these castings were cast many years ago. Uh, so it's now ready for doing some uh, microchips. So I think on my next, probably my next video to do with this, I mean, I'm going to say this is finished in inverted commas because I've still got other accessories and other bits and pieces I want to do to it but it's basically I'm going to call it finished because at some point in time you've got to say job done aren't you um, so probably its first project I might have mentioned this, this in another video uh, over on uh, Model Engineering Adventures that's Michelle and Andy I bumped into their channel a few weeks back and I saw some really nice sterling engines that they'd done, some hot air engines. So I think for the first project for this, I might do a, a very simplified version of a sterling engine or a hot air engine or low temperature differential engine, whichever you want to call it. Yeah, I'll do a simplified version, I think, and make that its first project. So anyway, uh, it's been a long haul, but... I finally got there um, so uh, I just want to thank everybody for uh, sticking with me on this project and I'll catch up next part to this then uh, I know I keep saying that but there will be parts to it you know but I'm going to call this the final completed version in inverted commas so uh, if you found that useful and interesting, give me a thumbs up and a subscribe, I'd appreciate that. And I'll catch you on the next part then. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.